السلام علیکم و رحمۃ اللہ وبرکاتہ ہیلو گڈ آفٹر نون فرینڈس وی نو ڈیٹ وی آر کریٹنگ اکاؤنٹنگ ایپلیکیشن ان پائتھن جینگو سو ٹوڈے آئی ول گیو یو دا ڈیمو وٹ وچ وٹ فردر ورک ہیز بین ڈن ان اور سسٹم سو فسٹ وی کین لاگ ان وی آر یوزنگ دا جینگو پائتھن جینگو اتھینٹیکیشن جینگو اتھینٹیکیشن سسٹم وی آلریڈی سی آل دیس تھنگ ان اکاؤنٹ ٹائپس مین اکاؤنٹس سب اکاؤنٹس آل دی ڈیمو آلریڈی اویلیبل ان مائی پلے لسٹ آف یوٹیوب چینل سو ناؤ جسٹ وی وی کین سی دا جنرل اینٹری still there is no data here so first we can see the our dashboard backend dashboard of django i can open here the dashboard here you can see there is no data in watcher watcher master and watcher detail so we are creating new entry here first you need you see here watcher number it is generating automatically number automatic number every time it will create new number so it will take the last number of jv type and then create new number if we will create the next maybe next time we can create the pay, payment voucher for that we can create another form so it will take the number new number for a pv and date is for current current date today date and time reference number here we can put the any reference number like for example if you are making this jv for payroll so we can put here the payroll document number or for example we are making the pt cash so we can put the here pt cash budget budget id number document reference number or if we are making the for against invoice or the procurement or sale invoice so we can put the sale invoice number or procurement for purchase and vendor supplier number gra number and vice number anything like and narration we can here we can enter the narration and this is main account and sub account sub account is actually before it was showing all the account sub account na? but now we create some changes using the django chain chain field system i will show you the technical thing later now here so for example if i will select the current account so it will show the only current account related number fixed account so it will show the fixed account there is no sub account created for fixed account direct expense so it will bring the direct expense number account account list other income so it will show the list of the current income so first we can select here the i may i am making making a entry for withdraw cash for sell lease So if we can select the current asset here and debit cash and and hand account here we can put any reference number i am making just for example uh pay september 2022 withdraw cash for for stuff service you draw cash for office stuff service of september october 2022 current asset now here i also change something java I as you use the javascript here for for example if i will put the debit amount so credit will be blank if i will put the credit automatically debit will be blank for example now if i put here uh, credit uh, so debit automatically blank and if i will put the debit amount automatically credit will be blank so i use the javascript here i will show you technical how i can did 
narration here this narration actually i created this is optional narration this will show you in ledger so we have to think what narration we have to enter here if this is current account ledger this ledger will be created cash in hand so i will put here for reference number for payroll so i will put copy this one or we can enter any narration here copy copy and then add line debit account cash in hand credit account we can put here a bank drug from bank and we can also use the check number also for example here i put put the check number check chq and same number i will copy here here paste and then save so it is saved here now we can see the data in our backend so it is showing here jv number one and narration is also coming and here posting date is blank posting date is blank posting date and post by post by user is also blank and watcher detail it is showing the two entries debit and credit entries create ubl account and debit cash so now one entry created here so now second thing we have the button for delete watcher and one button for post watcher so this delete watcher i have to work post i already done i will show you if now for example user created one watcher na? and if you want to delete the watcher so it is allowed to delete until he is not it is not posted and after posting it is not allowed delete only in that condition we can create another button reverse watcher entry reverse journal entry and another thing i show you here debit credit na? if i will put here for example 2500 instead and then i am going to post it will not allow to post it will show here the some debit and credit must be equal so we have in any condition we have to put equal debit and credit and then save and now we are we can see here you know it's still not posting posting is not came here and now we are going to post and it will show the message watch a general entry successfully posted and we can see the effect record you can see here the time is coming posting time and date now time is issue I something i have to fix this issue maybe time zone now i have to see the time zone and current time zone in my settings or pi file i will update no problem so it is showing okay So what backend work I have finished, I will show you. After this one, I have to create another button here for reverse. I have to create reverse the JV. And also for delete button is not still active. When delete will be delete, we can press the delete. It will allow show you, show us do you want to delete. If it is not posted, then allow the delete. Otherwise, it will not allow us to delete. So we can see now backend what work I have did. I have finished for making JV simply i you know already i show you before watcher master and watcher detail two models created watcher master and here i added posted posted date and posted by two fields and the second thing this this method i created in our class in our watcher master class model this one is for creating the jv number which we see here jv number na? so it is creating here 
and first it is using the Django ORM it is first, first it is fetching the last number JV number depending on the type filter watcher type is equal to watcher type dot last then if this object is found watcher then it will uh, using the fill z fill 10 I, yes, I first I will split this one watcher number and I will remove the watcher type and the remaining I will add and maximum one number and if it is first time then it, it will be show here it will come one so like this and watcher detail I close this one sub account and I created chain control field here chain control field actually what is I show you this is for actually mapping smart select Django smart select I will show you here uh, Django smart select this is actually package Django smart select it is using for chain field all details are here how we can install at what first we can install the Django smart select then add the URL jQuery URL is equal to true in setting.py then how we can use chain field chain select here you can see same thing i copy here and i put here sub account chain field main account depending any our main field this is our primary key this is foreign key this is foreign key depending in in, in sub account na? see in sub account you can see here this is primary key this is foreign key sub account i show you sub account uh, sub account you see here main account depending on the main account and sub account also is here so in watcher detail chain field here we can see chain model name show all is equal to false any if for example if it is only it will show which is related auto choose is equal to true automatically if only one field will there it will come i show you auto true for example i put here direct expense so there is only account one account or it is coming here auto automatically so this one i use here send debit credit amount narration so like this we set and also i have to create another button here also for printing also for pdf printing so when delete button i have to enable printing and also reverse three button i have to then this jb will be finished then we can go on next step for watcher payment watcher or received watcher and i simply created i am using the view simple view i am using the function based view not class based view because same view I am using for creating the watcher and also for updating the watcher. For example, if you want to update something na, here, you can exit here. If I want to update, like this check number, I will update here. I will put sell, sell, great. You can go again it is updated so i am using the function based view it is taking the one key primary key and default is none in this view if the data is coming with pk with primary key so it is there is one for the program it is written here and it is coming without pk so for example if not pk and request mode is equal to post so what we have to do was initialize the form with posting because it is coming with post if data master data is valid then master data safe watcher master na, upside data this one this field will be safe and then then initiate the detail for this i am using the 
I show you form now. Inline form set factory. I am using the inline form set factory here. Inline for, for, for master detail. While bringing the multiple row. So we can here we can populate the form set and instance we have already instance here so it will bring the primary key here if form set is valid safe and redirect to same same location same same location watcher add which we created here watcher add na same location it here i create two url one is with pk one is without pk same url same name so it will bring us here same with pk then next next time else if it is not if there is some error na, if form set is not valid if anything is not valid so it will return the same location with errors and for errors we are using the crispy form showing the apna, or using the bootstrap na? I am using the bootstrap also and I am using the crispy form also for example I show you another entry entry now I am going to save it will show this field is required this field is required so just you see here red color is coming na? all this I am using the crispy form and bootstrap also Even crispy form is also using bootstrap, but where I need the bootstrap, I use the bootstrap. Where I need the crispy form, I use that one. So like that, it was throwing the error. If it is not valid, so it is here is no valid, not valid because this field is required. So it is returning the same location, same URL with error. If it is with PK then it will update very simple and for posting what i did it is checking it is checking the debit or credit input when we are pressing this button you know here is posting is not coming posting is come only when it will be safe for example if it is safe it is posting will come and now i will put another condition if it is already posting that then it will not come the data button here button is showing here na? even after posting button will be here, not here so it is checking the debit credit not equal then it is throwing the message message django message system message dot error and redirect the same location and user i will take the user user from request dot user and convert this user to str and save in and now here watch your master update so that's it so that's work is now up to finish so inshallah i will see next what we have to do i will what changes i will finish i will show you inshallah thank you very much assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh